The Prime Minister has sparked another civil war thanks to a captain's call. Scott Morrison has installed Labor turncoat Warren Mundine as the Liberal candidate for a marginal New South Wales seat at the expense of Grant Schultz, who'd already been pre-selected. But it's the Prime Minister who's suggesting Mr Schultz is a bully. Contrasts in campaigning. Peace off the central Queensland coast. Bill Shorten announces funding for Great Keppel Island. The jewel in the Queensland tourism crown. War on the New South Wales south coast as Prime Minister Scott Morrison explodes the Liberal pre-selection and installs his own candidate. I'm very happy to introduce my mate, but a good bloke, and who I think will be an outstanding candidate here in Gilmore, Warren Mundine. Warren Mundine, the nuclear option. The Liberal Party is the home for me. The casualty? Local Libs had already pre-selected real estate agent Grant Schultz He'll now run as an independent. I am disappointed. I am very disappointed. The PM saying he had it coming for challenging sitting member and Sudmalis. You don't get to bully your way into a seat in the Liberal Party. That's not how it works. Mundine brings one quality in spades, controversy. As president of the Labor Party, he advocated for nuclear power plants and now at odds with the PM on Australia Day. Yes, I'd like to see the date change. I've got a hundred different things in front of that before I even get to that gate. The coalition fireworks have only helped build Shorten's bus ride north through the Queensland marginals. The opposition leader has been able to mix a string of targeted promises with potshots about government disarray. In Mackay, Tim Lester, 7 News.